We are going to simplify expression C. 2 root 6 minus 5 root 3 quantity times 4 root 2 minus 8 quantity. Well, we'll do it either one of two ways. Um, first of all, what we have to do is expand binomial times binomial. We want to multiply 2 root 6 times 4 root 2. So in order to multiply 2 root 6 times 4 root 2, we multiply the portions outside of the square root sign. 2 times 4 equal 8. 2 times 4 is 8. And then we multiply the portions inside the square root sign. 6 times 2 is 12. And therefore, by the laws of exponents, root 6 times root 2 is root 12. 2 root 6 times negative 8 is negative 16 root 6. Negative 5 root 3 times 4 root 2 is determined by multiplying negative 5 and, neg and positive 4 to get negative 20. Root 3 and root 2 becomes root 6. And finally, negative 5 root 3 times negative 8 uh, is expressed by determining negative 5 times negative 8, which is positive 40. And then the root 3 uh, has no um, counterpart in terms of an irrational factor in this term, so it remains root 3. Now, uh, we see that we cannot uh, reduce root 6, root 6, or root 3. But we can reduce root 12. Root 12 has a perfect square that divides evenly into it, specifically 4. So to simplify 8 root 12, we can do either one of two methods. Under method 1, we see that uh, 4 divides evenly into 12, which means uh, we can factor out root 4 from root 12. Uh, root 4, we can express 8 root 12 as 8 root 4 root 3. Root 4 is 2, so we can express 8 root 4. 12 as 8 times 2 times root 3. 8 times 2 is 16, and we get 16 root 3. So 8 root 12 has been simplified to 16 root 3. Uh, method 2, uh, we take a look at the uh, irrational factors of each term, and we see that the only one that we can uh, simplify is root 12, because it's the only one that has a perfect square that divides evenly into it. So we um, look at the number 12 itself and we determine its uh, prime factors. 12 is equal to 2 times 2 times 3. Now since the factor of 2 appears twice in the prime decomposition of 12, uh, we can take it outside of the square root sign and since 3 only appears once it remains inside. So 8 root 12 becomes 8 times 2 times root 3 which is 16 root 3. Regardless of which method we used, this expression comes down to here and becomes 16 root 3 minus 16 root 6 minus 20 root 6 plus 40 root 3. And at this point we look to collect like terms. 16 root 3 plus 40 root 3 is 56 root 3. Negative 16 root 6, negative 20 root 6. Um, we have uh, as our final answer 56 root 3 minus 36 root 6.